All right, YouTube Nation, for what's going on about Candy Course. And right now it is December 12th, the global release date of Brawl Stars on the iOS and Google Play Store. As anyway, guys, I'm a huge Clash Royale fan, a huge Clash of Clans fan in my kid uh, childhood. So literally, why not continue the Supercell fan page and download the third app called Brawl Stars, right? So in my opinion, the big breakdown between Clash of Clans and Clash Royale are, are you know, there are some same troops right in the game. But Clash Royale, you don't have to be on every second like Clash of Clans was. So Clash of Clans, people can attack you, um, steal your loot. You have shields. You know, you know, you you know, you can lose loot, lose trophies. Clash of Clans is more of like a they want to make you on 24/7. Clash Royale is it doesn't really make you on every single minute, but at the same point you want to because you want to get more chests. And you want to go back every four hours for that free chess. So this game right here, the only really thing with time is, is the bottom right hand corner. Um, you get like tokens unlocked every like so hours and minutes. So you can like you can literally only gain like you can gain trophies infinitely. But if you want to gain these things called tokens for the bottom left, the bottom left there are like star tokens and. Um, Skull tokens, whatever. I don't know what they're called, but just bear with me right here because it's my first day playing the game. Um, but I'm a huge Supercell guy, so why not try this game out? I don't want to talk, 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 talk. I just want to say really three things, okay? First of all, um, you can choose your character. So you start off with Shelly, but you, you know, then, then you go to Nita and Colt, and you will pretty much unlock these guys as you go with trophies. So it's not like Clash of Clans or Clash Royale where you have to like unlock them via you know chests by luck or via Alexir. You know you have, you have, to, you have to like buy it via Alexir. Um, no, it's just unlocked if you reach the trophy requirements, right? And then right here there are one-time rewards. There are one-time, one-time trophy rewards as you go and progress on the game. Also, make sure you check the shop. Right there on the daily deals, you, you literally get free coins just by checking the shop, right? So a free 16 coins, okay? So, now, there are two game modes, okay? Showdown, gem grab. I recommend doing uh, Shelly just because she's my highest overall, my highest uh, leveled up person, so we're going to play with Shelly right now. So, I do not like this game right here called the gem grab. Um, so, I'm just going to play until at the same time. Pretty much, you like this is what like this is what I get out of it, right? You want to control the middle field. Like, the middle was like, you know, World War II, like the trenches. You want to control the middle. You want to hide, gain health, fight back, okay? Now, make sure you got right there. See right there? That, that button, that yellow button was my super attack. Don't forget that button. So, that will give you right here. Boom! Okay, so that will give you so much of an advantage when you use it. Now, how does that button become available to you? That yellow button recharges every time you hit an opponent. So, it, you know, it's not time-based. The more hits on an opponent that you, yeah, that you get hit points from him, literally you will receive more yellow little power-up crap, okay? I think it's called like a superpower, whatever you want to call it. Make sure you guys hide, regenerate health, and then go back. Right now, health, 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 and go back in the field. This, this one's dumb. Like, this gem one, like, unless you have friends, like, like, this is just dumb. Like, this game mode's dumb. Um, I usually just, you know, shoot, 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 hide. Um, now, Shelly has three shots, and then her shots, like, you have to wait. Right there, boom. Okay, right there, yell power right there. So 12, 11, 10. So we won this one easily. The big thing in this game mode, guys, that, you know, you want to know the objective. You know, don't go and, you know, kill opponents. Um, you know, oh my God, go kill, go, go kill our team. No, you're going for the gems. So you want to control the middle arena, right? So right there, ooh, I'm a star player. Let's go, I'm a star player. Okay, that really means nothing, but you just, you, oh, I'm a star, okay? So right there are six trophies, cool. So you guys can see right there the token rewards. You get XP and you also get trophies for Shelly, okay? So I'm going to exit. That game mode is trash. Unless you have friends or people you want to play with that are like, you know them, and you know, you can talk in the same room, go, go, behind there, get that one, you know? Because obviously it's more fun if you're playing with your friends, right? So that's a good game for like friends you know, right? So literally these two things down here, in the, in, you know, in the bottom left, 
Those are like chests in Clash, Clash Royale. So they'll give you coins, they'll give you cards, and then those cards of like, you know, 20 Shelly cards, or um, 20 Nita cards, or 10 Colt cards. And then you upgrade them, you know, the health, the super. The super is that yellow button. And then the attack, of course, right? So now my favorite game, I already won like five of these. I like solo, right? So right here, we'll, we'll probably end up playing about, uh, we'll do two of these games right here for you guys. So right here, right? Showdown, okay? So this game is more of a strategy game. So for all you strategy people, this is the best game right here. You want to go for these chests right here. Now, I was wondering, you know, what are these chests for? You know, is it, you know, is it like health stuff? No. Like these chests, they, they like, they actually increase your health maximum. So these, these chests right here, they give you these things called like lightning bolt green crap. So I'm going to call them lightning bolts. So the more lightning bolts you get, literally that increases your health capacity. So you're not increasing your health. You're increasing your you're increasing your maximum health you can hold, which is huge, right? So I don't know why so many people are fighting. Like it makes no sense. I mean, I know that like you gain more lightning bullets for every kill, but at the same point, like you don't get any more XP or rewards for every kill you get. Okay? And right here, we're gonna get destroyed, so we're gonna leave here. Oh my god, dude. That oh my god. That game did not go off for us. We gotta come back. Okay, and we got to fight back, okay? That game was awful. I am usually not that bad. Um, it's just very hard to, like, really talk and really concentrate at the same time. I know it's kind of like multitasking. I can't really multitask as much as I really want to in my life, but whatever. It kind of set me back a little bit in life, but god damn, dude. Um, so that one right there, eh, you know, we, we could have a little bit better. So right here, you want to go for chess, okay? Watch Wi-Fi, watch Wi-Fi lighting, okay? Watch Wi-Fi bad, okay? All right, so right here, two chests. Let's go for it. Literally, this may look dumb, but you want these chests. These chests give you, like right now I'm at 4,300. 4,300, now look. 4,700, see? So you're, like, it, it doesn't increase health, it increases your maximum health. Right here, two chests. Like, if no one wants it, not my problem. Literally, I took hits right there, but I can just hide, and then I get it back, see? So, the thing I, like, we'll talk pros and cons now for the last four minutes of the game right now for the video. Pros. This game's fun, right? Um, like, it's a very strategy game, you know, this, that. But, honestly, the hates, I don't like how there's no kill incentive. That is, like, if I get more, okay, fuck this, dude. Like, Fuck, I hate that guy. That guy gets me, bro. That guy gets me, dude. All right, we, we, and we got one trophy, okay? So, overall, pros and cons. Um, guys, I won so many of those showdowns. Like, I, like, right now, I won four, and I lost, like, five. So, I am actually, like, that's your best chance to get trophies right there. You can get, like, eight or nine trophies uh, by winning. And you get, like, six if you come in second. So, if you hide... Come in second, you get like good trophies still, okay? And then trophies unlock these, un unlock these right here, okay? So, to end the video, um, pros and cons. I don't like how you get more, like, you should be able to get more trophies or like more tokens based on your amount of kills. Because in Showdown, I can just hide and then win, and I get the same thing as if, as if someone killed five brawlers, right? Another bad thing is that I don't like the health system. I feel like that, like, if you're able to just regenerate health for free, like, you should be able to, like, health should not be able to regenerate that fast, you know? Because, you know, if I'm getting hit and hit and hit, I can just, you know, I can, you know, run away, hide, regroup, replenish my health, fight back, all right? I don't like that, okay? I really like the, um, the chess, um... I don't know. Like I feel, like, I feel like what they should do is that, that you know they should have events where um, it's all the same card. So requirements, you can only use Shelly or requirements. You, you know you can always use Nika or uh, who's the brawler? Is it Nika? 
Nita, Nita. So that way it's fair game. I don't like how people already have, you know, these ones down here. Like people are playing with Brock. You need 1,000 trophies already. So I don't know how they got them already. Probably got it before the game came out, whatever. But um, it's just unfair. You know, I have Shelly, and here they have the, the, the missile guy, right? The missile guy, Brock, is unlocked later in the game for a reason, right? So give me your thoughts. I suck, guys. Oh, my God. You know, I won the gem challenge. The gem challenge is really easy. You know, if you have a smart team, you and two others, literally just control the middle control the gem mine, hide, replenish behind a wall, regenerate health, fight back, control that front, uh, um, what do they call it, of the, uh, the trenches, right? Control that trench in the middle of the gem mine. For the showdown one, right? Go for the boxes, get the match from health, fight at the end. I usually do pretty good in those matches. I suck to his video. It doesn't mean I'm gonna re-record like, I'm not going to, like, re-record this video just so I can, you know, win for you guys, okay? You guys get the point, okay? Um, I will make a clan or a club if I can. So, create club. So, I will create a club at level 5 for you guys. So, just wait until I, you know, create a club. Once I create a club, I will make a video. But until then, maybe subscribe and then be ready for my club. All right, so I'm a huge gamer, guys. I'm ready. I have been, you know, really good for Clash Royale, good for Clash Clans. I'm learning. Let me learn this game, and I will master it by maybe like, you know, two or three days, okay? So we will have specific, you know, tips and tricks for attacking each brawler probably by this weekend. But the big thing is, can we have that club made in about two or three days? I'll see you then, guys. Have fun and download Brawl Stars.